President Trump also focusing on battleground states. Tonight, he held a rally in Pennsylvania, but will be coming back to Georgia next week. He's scheduled to speak at a rally in Duluth on Wednesday, and today a rally for LGBTQ Trump supporters was held at the Marriott Hotel and Conference Center in Buckhead. Atlanta News first reporter Brittany Ford was there. And Brittany, this is part of a national tour, right? Well, yeah, and it's called Trump Unity, and organizers here say this is an expansion of the 2020 Trump Pride Coalition. This event here tonight is one of several to be hosting across the nation, looking to appeal to a variety of voters. A room filled with members of Atlanta's LGBTQ community and beyond in support of former President Donald Trump. Charles Moran is president of the Log Cabin Republicans who organized the event. Log Cabin Republicans is the nation's oldest and largest organizations of LGBT Republicans, conservatives and our straight allies. Moran says the Trump Unity National Tour sheds light on what can be a hidden demographic within the political party, but says the campaign is aimed to reach beyond that. And we're looking at, again, not just gays, it's it's disaffected Democrats, it's independents, it's youth voters, it's people that the conservative movement has sometimes left out or have not spoken to. The event featured a number of speakers that highlighted and energized strides the Trump campaign has made for the LGBTQ community. Donald Trump is the first president in America, American history to enter office as a supporter of marriage equality. Moran says the goal is to create a sense of belonging. It's talking about this broadening and opening of our conservative values to everyone who wants to participate, regardless if you identify as a traditional conservative or not. Now the tour's next stop will be in Charlotte, North Carolina next week. Reporting live in Buckhead, Brittany Ford, Atlanta News First.